hello everyone in this video uh, we are going to see a solid modeling which is in CAD access book and to start with it uh, select a part design by file new and part then click ok and the axis can be selected uh, as you wish and click on sketch option and to start with uh, any solid model uh, we should view we should view only a front view and the basic lines are the dimensions in 60 mm and 70 mm so we can construct a line with the help of profile command and after creating these lines it can be dimensioned uh, with the help of constraint command which is at the right and to pad or pocket uh, any object it must be a closed profile the dimensions are 60 mm and 70 mm and note that in CATI access book all the dimensions will be in millimeter And this 10 mm dimension is also given in that uh, model and this bottom line is uh, 60 mm and the vertical line has a uh, dimension of uh, 70 mm thus this sketch is profiled and constrained and now it's time to pad it Um, the padding dimension is given as 90 mm that is 45 plus 35 plus 10 and thus padding is done Next to draw a chamfer part, select a surface you need and click on sketch option and profile it accordingly. And the dimension between these is given as 10 mm in the exercise book. as it is mentioned there these two lines must be coincide with each other to pad an object correctly By selecting two lines, uh, an additional option is able above the constraint dialog box and with the help of that uh, you can coincide the lines. The required dimension is given now. Exit from the sketch and click on pad option uh, to perform the operation. The dimension is given as 10 mm. and do the same uh, on the other side of the body
and as we done earlier uh, these has a dimension of 10 mm these two lines must be coincide with each other and it also has a dimension of 10 mm and the similar options are selected to perform the same method the outline of the body is obtained and next uh, the pocket option must be used to remove mass from the surface so click on the surface and select sketch option uh, to perform any operation in that particular surface The dimension is given as 15 mm on all the sides and hence it is a square. And from the center of the square to the bottom, the dimension is given as 25 mm. and and the dimension is 25 mm and the square is placed at the center of the surface so we know that the padding length is 90 mm so the center can be uh, 45 mm that is half of the total length the pocket operation is done and next there is a pocket on the other surface so the similar operations are uh, done to make the pocket on that surface so click on the surface and sketch the rectangle with the required dimensions by using a rectangle command The dimension is given as uh, 35 mm. The dimension of the other side is 15 mm. The purple color uh, indicates that. Uh, it's over, over constrained so in the sketches constrained over so it cannot be pad or pocket and, in, and any operations cannot be done when it's over constrained and this, it, this sketch also uh, is present at the center So as I said earlier, the center can be done with the help of uh, total length by 2. 
So now it's fully constrained. So click on pocket option uh, to perform the operation. And that's it. Uh, we got the required uh, model. Thank you for watching. Do subscribe the channel Cat Gadgets for more videos. Thank you.